How y'all doing? It's August uh, 5th, 2021. I was watching DeSantos down in Florida today. He was talking to a couple of the larger hospitals. And they were talking about beds and who was filling the beds and what cases were filling the beds. And they gave out numbers today. And I remember the numbers from back a year ago or so when this all started. How they said there was no room in any of the beds and you couldn't get into a hospital and they couldn't take care of you. So I put a little, uh, about 40 something seconds of it together, the highlights of the bed counts. And uh, if you want, I'll put a link in the description down below and you can check it out for yourself, all right? Just think about it. What they told us last year and what's going on now, it doesn't match up. You all have a good day and watch the video. Let's see. At TGH right now, we have 126 COVID patients. We're a 1,041 bed hospital. That's a little over 10% of our beds are devoted right now to COVID patients. There's no question, Governor, that our ERs are full and we are busy, that we have the most COVID patients that we've ever had through the pandemic, but we are a large hospital, uh, the hospital is probably one of the safest places to be if you're looking not to not to get COVID, correct? That is correct. exactly correct, uh, Governor. And to add to John's point, we are 21%, which is similar to Shane, on a, a number of COVID patients that we have. At our peak last summer, we were at 49% of our census. So we're dramatically lower. 